what's going on youtube welcome to the channel thanks for checking out the channel and if you're new to the channel make sure you hit that like button and hit the subscribe button and hit the notify button where we're always dropping new toyota tacoma content guys all right so i took another one of these trucks on a test drive and uh, this is a really good looking one you'll probably see this one on the channel you guys know how i do it a couple times but i just wanted to talk about these trucks just really quick this is a really really nice sport right here and since we're over here we'll just give you guys a price because they did a really good job on this one here i think they added like $6,000 worth of dealer installed options and it's $49,000. I mean, that's not bad, $6,000. You could probably do a little better yourself, but you are getting the $2,000 discount. So that's like the biggest thing that I want to tell you guys. They're doing discounts on these trucks and you know they got a lot of SR5s and things like that on the lot, but they have a lot of these trucks on a lot. This dealership has a ton of these trucks, but after you know going on my test drive again, I think I've driven about, I've had about four or five test drives and I'm convinced, I'm sold on these trucks. They drive good, you got good acceleration, and they look good, and they got all the tech, and they're just awesome looking trucks, and they look even nicer when they're lifted. So I'm sold. So if you guys been wondering, this is a this is an off-road here. So we haven't been seeing a lot of these. This is a bigger there's the man right there behind all the madness. You got all these trucks looking nice, man. Yeah, man, these things drive good too. So I'm sold. Oh, this is a three inch? What about that one? I think that's two and a half. Okay, and then the white one? I think two and a half. Okay, this is a three inch. So let's look at this three inch. Okay, yeah, okay. So yeah, they got the ready lift upper control arm. So you guys holler at him if you guys trying to get some accessories added to your vehicle because he does a good job of doing all that stuff. That's John Scott. Make sure you tell him little Kenny sent you. So yeah, they got the ready lift in this one. This looks a lot. We've seen that three and a half inch lift. This is just a three inch lift here. But yeah, these trucks are awesome, guys. I really do like them a lot. Um, that's why I come up here and do all of the reviews because I just like seeing them. Here's another one. And I'm not a fan of the ball hall blast, but man, look at the poke on these. So this probably got a two and a half inch lift. I said like a one and a half. This probably got a two and a half inch lift to cover this one. John, what about this one? Okay, so if it ha if it's higher than two and a half, it's gonna be uh, three inches. It'll have upper control arms. Nice. Okay. Well, now we know. If you didn't know, now you know. But yeah, guys, that's all I really wanted to really say is that I do like these trucks a lot, and I think I think they're good running trucks. So we'll have to see how these turbocharged engines hold up, you know, and how these transmissions do, but. I haven't seen anything blasted all over the internet yet talking about another transmission is failing or anything like that. So we've had a couple isolated ones, but I'm sold on them. And um, yeah, I'm pretty much sold on these bad boys. I am sold. So we'll go get over here and I'll just walk you guys through and show you guys more of these trucks because they got a ton of them on the lot before I get out of here. So yeah, I'm sold guys. I'm pretty much sold on them. And people are buying them. People are definitely buying them. I guess in Q1, Q1, they were showing me, I don't, people were trying to tell me that Q1, I don't know what they were trying to tell me. They were trying to tell me that they, they had the most sales or somebody was saying that Toyota was outselling uh, Nissan by like almost three times. So somebody bought this one. This is an off-road. But yeah, I guess in Q1, they didn't do that good. But in Q2, like we're in like Q2 now, right now, quarter two, basically. And uh, I'll just show you guys all of these ones because I didn't really show you guys all of these ones. But yeah, it's just a nice truck. You know, they had this, they had this guy right here, the third generation. It's not a bad looking truck, but well, this one is a bad looking truck because it got a big old dent in the back. Like somebody done messed up. Somebody done messed up, but it's not a bad looking truck let's just kind of look at it it's a six foot bed and let's see what they're talking about come on you guys got to do better you got to do better 41 almost forty two thousand dollars, and it's dented like something's in it but it has a sunroof and it has leather what year is this a 2021 it got camera you know me i always gonna see if it got a camera but yeah i with the old and then with the new you guys so yeah so i got action man i got action at getting at probably getting a pro you know, I got action at getting a trail hunter or a pro. 
and you know which way I'm gonna go, you know? So they got, they got some more sports up here. A ton of these trucks on the lot. So I think like, I really didn't want to get a trail hunter. I really didn't. I really don't really like the wheels on the trail hunter. And after seeing that, uh, after seeing that, uh, that Terra TRD Pro, you guys seen me, man. I don't, I lost my mind up in there, but, uh, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna take a picture right here. We'll use a little, but yeah, these trucks drive good. I was just, I was out here chilling, doing my video and, and whatnot, and have you, and they just had one just started. Let's see if they got another one started out here because we'll hop in that and drive some more. But it was a six foot bed off road, kind of like this one. It's probably the one it was 14 inch screen. I was just cruising for a bruising, and I saw you guys some more trucks. I don't know if I took you guys. We'll go look at the bronze oxide one more time. But yeah, these trucks are looking. So let's look at this black one because I'm thinking about maybe getting a black one. And I hate, I hate, I hate to get black, but that black is that. Look at that four by four. That's that back to the future. That's that back to the future. It gets you off your computer. But yeah, the final, my final verdict is Gen 4Z. Uh, you know, maybe the Gen 4 ain't for you, but I can tell you guys. Oh yeah, I wanted to check out. I think this one's sold. Let's go see what's up with this one. But you guys know I've had three third generation Tacomas and it's a nice truck and it's a V6 and you know, there's plenty of them on the road. They've been on the road since 2016. So this one is sold. They selling these joints. So this one's got some options and ain't got that many options because I can tell you right here, it ain't fully loaded. It ain't fully loaded, but it do got a roof. Oh, we, who sold it? Caleb sold it, okay. So holler at Caleb, you guys. Holler at John Scott and holler at my boy, Yasser. And holler at LT. But yeah, $49,000 for this one. And that's the TRD off-road upgrade package. They hit you for $4,600 and they got the moon roof. So this is a nice package. This is basically the same truck that I'm gonna show you guys tomorrow. So and right next to a Grand Highlander, so not blacked out but it's sold it's sold so yeah these things are selling guys this is the best mid-size truck on the planet fourth generation it just you know they just beat they just beat them out they just beat the uh the third generation now now i think you guys this is the weird part of the body style right here because it looks like a big old dent it's kind of weird right here i've always said it this piece right here these body lines right here how it comes it's almost like a diamond shine bright like a diamond i don't know what they was doing but hey so yeah this is that trd sport this is fully loaded so this was the only fully loaded truck on on the whole lot and this is actually for a um toyota employee from you know from wherever i don't know where he works at but he's a toyota employee so he ordered this thing with everything on it for for the tuna Fifty-eight thousand dollars, fifty-seven thousand nine hundred and twenty-six. So I think he got every single option you could possibly get, including the upgraded wheels, the accessory wheels, and this is in the bronze oxide. This is our first one that we've seen, and it's sold. And there's that camera. So yeah, these things are really, really nice. They're just beautiful trucks. So and they drive good. I know it's a four cylinder, but it is turbocharged and you are gonna get, you're gonna get 278 horsepower and you're gonna get 317 pound feet of torque, which is 50 more pound feet of torque than the V6. So than the previous generation. And to me, the truck just looks better. It looks more modern. And this is what, what I would like to be driving for the next few years. Who knows what the next, what the fifth generation will look like. But uh, yeah, let's go look at some of these other ones over here. But yeah, none of these, none of these other ones over here have sunroof. There's Yasser right there. All right, take care of me, Yasser. All right, have a good one. So make sure you guys holler at Yasser. So here's, oh, okay, what we got here? We got a little SR5 and it does have a sunroof. I just don't want one of these. I want one, but I don't want one. This one's nice. It has everything that I would want except except for the uh doesn't have a camera. Let's see what kind of discount they got though. See, they want $51,000 for the SR5 premium and a discount of 250 bucks. Get out of here. They need to put 2000 
250. But this is a nice truck too, so you still can get a V6, but we just went, this is basically a Tacoma SUV. So I would have to wait for the 4Runner. If I'm ever gonna get a 4Runner, it'll probably be, what, a fifth generation? No, yeah, fifth generation. I think they're on the fifth generation. I always get confused if they're on the fifth. I think they're on the fifth generation now. So it could be the sixth generation that's coming out, but that's why I'm not getting a four runner. I don't even know what generation they're on. I don't even know what generation they're on, but so we got a couple, couple off-roads here and a sport and another SR5. So these trucks are here. There's plenty of them and nobody's in a rush to get them. Nobody's out here but me, just me doing what I do. I'm just doing what I do. If you guys know who sings that song, let me know in the comments below. We just doing what we do when we do. And that was extra, but yeah. So plenty of Tacomas on the lot collecting dust on a daily, but I love these new trucks. If you guys didn't know, now you know. And you know, it's hard to come up with titles sometimes. You guys know I'm still getting into YouTube and I think we did a solid review when we hopped in that car that was just started up and we just drove it like we stole it. So we got to come up with a title for that one. But uh, that's going to do it, guys. Plenty of these trucks, plenty of cold weather packages. And hopefully we start to see more colors show up. You know, the hybrids will be showing up. I just talked to Yasser there. Hybrids will be showing up here shortly. So the hybrid motors, I'm, I'm really excited to test drive one of those. Now, that's what I'm excited for because I'm happy with I see why people buy these right now because, you know, if they wanted a new Tacoma, once you come test drive one and you're looking at it, you're pretty much sold. So I, I see why they're buying these and not buying the hybrid. Plus, the hybrid is going to cost a lot more money. But I'm excited to see if we can notice a difference, if it's worth buying the hybrid because you are going to get 326 horsepower and uh, 465 pound-feet of torque. Breathe in, breathe out. So this is a nice black one. So let's take a look at the black one because if I possibly, if I was possibly to get a black TRD Pro, it's gonna be trouble. But when it's clean, it's clean. Yeah, yeah, that black, I'm gonna get that black on black and black him out. Oh boy, Lord willing, Lord willing. But uh, yeah, that's gonna do it guys. I absolutely love these trucks and thanks for checking out the channel. You guys have a good day and God bless. We are out. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. We're trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by my birthday, which is August 2nd. It's free to subscribe. I know the channel's ghetto and low budget and I mess up a lot. We don't do no editing or anything like that because we ain't got time for all that. We don't got time for all that. Does it look like I got time for all that or does it even look like I know how to do all that? So once the channel gets a little bit more bread, I'm gonna just hire somebody, Lord willing. But that's gonna do it, guys. Look, they got the gunmetal Tacoma in the back. This is a nice little one underground right here. I can't even let, I can't let go. And that's like that gunmetal or something or rather there. And this is the nice, this got some options. This is a TRD Sport with options. Would they throw on the roof too? No. Do we got a discount? Let's go swing it around to the discount side of things. And then we're going to get out of here. Blue Crush. Blue Crush. So yeah, they're doing like 2,500 bucks off of this one. So $46,000. Yay, yay. We be clubbing. But they got the flex portable speaker and the 8 inch. And you should with the plus package, yeah, you get power seats too, so you're good to go. You ready like Freddy. But that's going to do it, guys. Have a good day, and God bless. Peace.